Hello, and welcome to the Inspired Living with Ellen Broderick podcast. This week, I am going to share the third in a series of four meditations that focus on a different John O'Donohue passage, um, or in one case, passages. Um, and this one is a lovely uh, poem that reflects on blessings. So let's just get to it again. It's going to be short. Um, probably this will be between about five minutes in all. So get yourself comfortable. Sitting up is as good a position as any, or you can get yourself in another position that's comfortable. Allow your sits bones to rest down as your torso lifts upward with your shoulders directly over your hips. And then let your, your chin be neutral. Let your ears be over your shoulders. Close your eyes or soft gaze downward and come to your breath. Letting go of the cares and worries of the day. Being present to all that is in this moment. I'm feeling the body expand with the inhalation. And feel everything move back toward center with the exhalation. A few more conscious breaths. If your mind wanders, just bringing it gently, persuasively back. And the title of this and the, the, the poem that I'm going to be sharing is from To Bless the Space Between Us. For celebration. Now is the time to free the heart. Let all intentions and worries stop. Free the joy inside the self. Awaken to the wonder of your life. Open your eyes and see the friends whose hearts recognize your face as kin. Those whose kindness, watchful and near, encouraging you to live everything here. See the gifts the years have given. Things your effort could never earn the health to enjoy who you want to be and the mind to mirror mystery. I'll read it through once more and then we'll have just a few moments of silence. For celebration, now is the time to free the heart let all intentions and worries stop. Free the joy inside the self. Awaken to the wonder of your life. Open your eyes and see the friends whose hearts recognize your face as kin. Those whose kindness, watchful and near, encouraging you to live everything here. See the gifts the years have given, things your effort could never earn, the health to enjoy who you want to be, and the mind to mirror mystery.
and bringing your attention to the sounds around you. Noticing the touch of the air on your skin. Noticing the point at which air is moving in and out of your nostril or your mouth. And then bring your attention to your heart. And allow the heart to know that you care deeply and appreciate completely the work that the heart does for you day in and day out. And when you're ready, opening the eyes. Coming back together, I often like to look at something far away initially and acclimate instead of to a screen to nature if possible or perhaps a plant or flowers that might be in your home if far away is out if the outside world is not possible to see at this time and I hope you enjoyed that. I love the words of John O'Donohue. So that's why we're having this four part series. So next week will be the fourth one. And I look forward to seeing you there for the Inspired Living with Ellen Broderick podcast. Have a great week. Thanks.